At least a dozen images spring to mind at the mention of Florida, one of the most popular tourist destinations in the United States. For many, it's Orlando's world-famous theme parks at Disney World and Universal, while others may think of the nearly endless number of championship golf courses that are scattered throughout the Sunshine State. With more than 8,000 miles of shoreline, the Sunshine State is prime vacation territory. With so many diverse destinations in Florida, it can be hard to pick which place is right for your next getaway. And that's why we rounded up 10 of the best places to visit in Florida. And keep watching to find out. In Florida, water bugs and sun worshippers have hundreds of beaches to choose from, and retail connoisseurs will find luxury stores and quirky boutiques in abundance in each city. If your trip is based around a beach vacation or specific activity, you may want to consider the climate and best time of the year to visit Florida. Beyond the entertainment and recreation, Florida has a rich historical and cultural past featuring peaceful natives, Spanish conquistadors, swashbuckling pirates, and generations of Caribbean influences that make it an incredibly interesting and diverse place to visit. And that said, here are the 10 best places to visit in Florida. Number 10. Clearwater Located between the Gulf of Mexico and Tampa Bay, northwest of St. Petersburg, Clearwater is a famous family holiday destination known for its three-mile-long spectacular beach, fantastic weather, and a long, narrow barrier reef. The beach is lined with fancy hotels, resorts, bars, and restaurants. Take the kids to see the Clearwater Marine Aquarium, where injured dolphins and sea turtles are brought to recover and get rehabilitated. Check the game at the Bright House Field, where the Phillies baseball team comes for spring training. Stroll down Pier 60 to see the sunset and the street artists entertaining the crowds. Enjoy the shady boardwalk trails with Moccasin Lake Nature Park, or take a tour of the bay to see the playful dolphins in their own environment. Number 9. Orlando No other city in the United States, the world even, celebrates the spirit of childhood quite like Orlando, Florida. The feeling that you get when you catch the light off of Epcot Center Spaceship Earth, found in Walt Disney World Resort, of course, or from your first sip of butterbeer in Hogsmeade located inside Universal Orlando Resort, or when you witness the soaring heights of Shamu's acrobatics during the One Ocean Water Show at SeaWorld Orlando, all prove that being a kid is about your state of mind, not age. Number 8. St. Petersburg Holding the Guinness World Record for the most consecutive days of sunshine, St. Petersburg is appropriately named the Sunshine City. The city provides visitors with a unique blend of a traditional beach getaway and urban flavor. The white sandy beaches offers views of spectacular sunsets, and the seven miles of waterfront parks invite travelers to enjoy a host of activities, including hiking, camping, and kayaking. An ongoing creative renaissance also promises an extensive cultural experience, whether it's through the world-class Dolly Museum or the Museum of Fine Arts, and every year more than 1,000 events are held in the city. Everything from St. Anthony's Triathlon to Rib Fest, a celebration of barbecued ribs and touring bands. These events are often held downtown, peppered with shops, restaurants, and craft beer pubs that come alive once the sun sets. With all that it has to offer, the sunshine-infused city is a popular destination for visitors of all ages. Families will love the relaxing outdoors and teeming wildlife, and the younger set will find plenty to do downtown, including the lively nightlife. Number 7. Key West with 120 miles of stunning tropical islands, the Florida Keys is a slice of paradise known for abundant water activities and laid-back vibes. The most famous and farthest island to the south of Florida, Key West offers a breathtaking view of the chain of islands that make up the Florida Keys. The drive to this stunning city is an event in itself. You'll cross a series of bridges that will have you marveling at the engineering that went into making this vacation resort a reality. Don't forget to grab a slice of Florida's signature key lime pie dessert, explore underwater marine life and coral reefs at John Pennekamp Coral Reef State Park, or take a snorkeling adventure to a 19th century fort at the world's most remote national parks in the state, Dry Tortugas. Number 6. Sarasota if you think this quaint city along Florida's west coast is like any other found in the state, think again. Sarasota regularly woos enthusiasts and collectors, featuring an impressive list of art-centric attractions like the John and Mabel Ringling Museum of Art, the Art Center Sarasota, and various craft shows and festivals. But art here isn't limited to traditional works like paintings and sculptures. Performing arts like ballet, opera, and circus acts are also a mainstay of this waterfront city. In fact, the circus is deeply embedded in Sarasota. John and Charles Ringling, two of the Ringling Brothers' circus founders, shortly after becoming a city in 1913. And what's more, John Ringling's former home, Cotizan, now serves as one of the city's top attractions. Number 5. Tampa 
With gorgeous coastline beaches and an abundance of fun-filled attractions, Tampa is on the top vacation destination in Florida for a reason. Get your thrills at Busch Gardens or Adventure Island. Cheer for the local football, baseball, or hockey team at one of their many sport events. Try your luck at the Hard Rock Casino or visit nearby St. Petersburg to see impressive art at the Salvador Dali Museum. For an outdoor adventure, dig your toes into the sand at the award-winning Clearwater Beach or find seclusion at Honeymoon Island and nearby Galadisi Island State Park. It's a paradise for foodies, beach bums, and art lovers alike. There are so many things to do in Tampa, you could never get bored. And number four, Naples. Named after the coastal Italian city, Naples, Florida is known for its laid-back ambiance, quiet luxury, and world-class golf. Though Florida's version doesn't have the history, sights, or artwork of its namesake, its extravagance mimics that of European waterholes along the Mediterranean. Instead of archaeological treasures and divine Italian food, you'll find high-end restaurants and first-class hotels awaiting those who retreat from the shore. With gently lapping waves on the white sand beaches of southern Florida's Gulf Coast, America's Napoli qualifies as one of the most relaxing and romantic beach destinations in the States. And that said, party animals and young families will probably want to seek another beach because Naples doesn't have the distractions, oops, we mean attractions, that they're looking for. Relaxation is the name of the game here, so leave the tots with your parents or the keg at the frat house, pick up your special someone, and venture down to Florida's city of love. Number three, Fort Lauderdale. To the citizens of Fort Lauderdale, their home offers quintessential Florida beaches, palm trees, shopping, and relaxation. Without the C and B scene attitude of the state's other beachside cities, you can be the judge if they're right, but certainly expect a different atmosphere than their close rival, Miami Beach. Fort Lauderdale's vast stretches of white sand surpass those of its southern neighbor and, to some, are the best shores statewide. And when you consider its fantastic scenery, great dining options, and a range of things to do, Fort Lauderdale is also somewhat affordable compared to similar vacation spots. The Venice of America, nicknamed for its 165 miles of waterways and canals, is slowly but surely climbing the ranks of top beach destinations to the cheer of its residents. Number 2. Pensacola Beach Pensacola is the westernmost city in the Florida's panhandle, which is why it's nicknamed the Western Gate to the Sunshine State. It's easy to see why it's a top-rated beach in Florida's panhandle, with its known brilliant white sand and turquoise water. Considered the epicenter of Florida's Gulf Coast, it has postcard-worthy beaches, and you're spoiled for choice with natural beauty. Pensacola is situated near the preserved Gulf Islands National Seashore, including offshore barrier islands with emerald waters, white powdery sand, and miles of undeveloped coastline. Many pilots, including Neil Armstrong and John Glenn, received their training at the Naval Air Station Pensacola, the Blue Angels Station. Number 1. Miami Beach Miami Beach is where a mix of cultures, residents, and travelers mingle. Many people, including waifish models, amateur architecture critics, distinguished seniors, and sun-seeking families, enjoy the renowned shores of America's Riviera. North Miami Beach is where you'll find the kid-friendliest beaches and the most affordable restaurants and hotels. Less than 10 miles away are the galleries, museums, and the theaters of Greater Miami. And then, there's South Beach. The popular southernmost neighborhood proves that Miami Beach is more like two cities, a family-friendly vacation when the sun is shining and a super chic metropolis come nightfall. If you want to keep up with the Joneses, you'll have to exercise your credit card at the high-end stores, schmooze at the cutting-edge fusion restaurants, and dance at the energetic nightclubs, and relax poolside at the Art Deco-style hotels. But the rich and famous aren't the only ones who will enjoy their time here. More laid-back travelers can relax along the sands of Hallover Park or Lummis Park, learn a little more about architecture on an Art Deco tour, or even try their hand at fishing off the South Point Pier. Another must-do, window shopping and strolling along the Lincoln Road Mall. And you can't leave Miami Beach without chowing down on tasty small plates and enjoying cocktails at a rooftop bar. So, what did you think? What are your thoughts on the top 10 places to visit in Florida? Which of these places would you visit first? And which do you think could rise up the charts? Let us know in the comment section down below. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for more of our awesome content. And please give us a like, share the video, and don't forget to turn on that notification bell for timely updates of our new uploads. And I'll see you next time on the channel.